Mr. Nevins, you're a good dude. Thank you you know. walked into a ready-made family as a young, young, young person. And for your efforts, you got derision, you got anger, you got a woman, a jealous woman chasing you around, and an STD. <laughs> she doesn't appreciate you, sir. She's got you babysitting her kids while she's going out all night. She's wondering why you can't be more of a father to the children she created with other men. She wants to know why she can't give more of your money when she's got a couple of child support checks coming in, she's got, she's got housing, she's done a disability check, and she don't, wants to know why you can't part with more of your check. Mm. Do you see what I'm telling you? I see it. Well, can, ain't nothing free, Your Honor. He's not finna just be with me just because, you know. I mean, he's gonna have to um, help out because. I pay all the bills, so. Your Honor, he does not. I pay, I pay all the bills and get Mr. Her Nevis, money, did so... you understand what I'm telling you? I'm not talking to her because I don't think she could hear me. I'm, I'm talking to somebody who I think can hear me. Can you hear me? I, I know. Am I I'm... saying anything that your family's ever told you? Yeah, they tell me that every time I see them. They just I don't know them, they don't know me, but we're both telling you the same thing. What does that tell you? Keep your family out your business. <laughs> Maybe I need to find a Mr. better Nevins, choice. Mr. Nevins, if you were my son, I would tell you to run. 